Hi, welcome to Chima class. Let's solve this simple problem on circle geometry. Solution? Okay, first, let's call here as M, then let's call here as Y degrees. Okay? Now, from angles in a straight line, we can now say that M degrees plus 60 degrees should give us 180 degrees. And our reason is angles in a straight line. Angles in a straight line. Okay, if you observe, you see something like this. So here is 60, and this is our M. So angles in a straight line will give us 180. So that M will be 180 degrees minus 60 degrees, which is 120 degrees. So if M is 120 degrees, can we find Y? Yes, opposite angles. Of a cyclic quadrilateral. Okay, some of opposite angles they are supplementary. So we have y degrees plus m degrees is 180 degrees. So our reason is sum of opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral. This, this diagram is a cyclic quadrilateral because all the vertices is touching the circumference of the circle. So the sum of the opposite angles should give us 180 degrees. Good. But our M is 120 already. Y plus 120 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. So that Y is equal to 180 degrees minus 120 degrees, which is 60 degrees. Yes. Y is a, this this system is an exterior angle to this uh, cyclic quadrilateral. So we can easily say Y is equal to 60 degrees. Reason is exterior angles of a cyclic quadrilateral. Is equal to the opposite interior angle. So exterior angle of a cyclic quadrilateral is equal to the opposite interior angle. That is why y is equal to 60 degrees. Or you can still follow this approach. Alright, now we have gotten y and m and the two x. Can we find this angle? Let's call it angle m. Now we have m is equal to 60 degrees plus x. So what is the reason now? The reason is what? Exterior angle, exterior angle of a triangle. If you look closely, you observe that we have a triangle like this. So this is our air. This is 60 degrees and this is x. For more on exterior angles of a triangle, please check my previous lessons. So this is an exterior angle to this. So it's some of the opposite interior angles. That's why we have 60 plus x. Y plus 2x plus m plus n should give us 360 degrees. The sigma of angles in a quadrilateral. The sigma of angles in a quadrilateral should be 360 degrees. But when this m is 60 plus x, let's substitute 60 plus x as m, and then put the value of m, where as well as y is 60 degrees plus 2x, plus what is m? m is 120 degrees, plus what is the value of m? 60 plus x, 60 degrees plus x, so it should be 360 degrees. Collect like things. So when we collect like things, 60 plus 60 is 120, plus 120 is 240 degrees, plus 3x, because 2x plus x will give us 3x is equal to 3. 3x is equal to 360 degrees minus 240 degrees, which is 120 degrees. Now, can we find x? Yes. So we have here that x is equal to 120 degrees divided by 3, which is 40 degrees. So we can now say that x, the value of x is equal to 40 degrees. Alright, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Like oh, wow. Cycle Geometry. Please check my playlist, my YouTube channel. Bye.